Americans love vintage trucks. Perhaps the most loved of all is what you see behind me. Chevrolet called this truck the Advanced Series. They were built after World War II and they're absolutely beautiful. Today we call them, or the popular nickname is Fat Fender Truck. Uh, you can see why. They have big, beautiful, round fenders. Uh, this particular truck is not only a fat fender truck, it's also a five window truck. Now, what is five window truck? Well, the standard truck built in this series doesn't have the corner windows. When you have the corner windows, like this deluxe cab here, you have a five window truck. And really, that's the one to have. Chevrolet's advanced design was heavily influenced by the Streamliner look. The Streamliner look was in almost everything you see. You can see it in the grill of this truck. And uh, it was in your common objects you'd have at home. An iron, a coffee pot, a bicycle. Streamliner was everywhere. And it's truly one of the industry's most beautiful design, period, uh, design periods, in my opinion. And while the design is beautiful, the streamlined look built into this truck, this truck was built for work, and work is what they did. America was built on the backbone of this truck right here. This particular truck, I don't think, saw much duty. If it did, there, it doesn't have the scars to prove it. It basically survived as built in 1950. Sometime in the past, it benefited from a restoration. The restoration is not by today's standards over the top better than factory. Uh, it's just well done, still very handsome. Not fresh and perfect, but absolutely gorgeous. A blast to drive. And in fact, today we're gonna go on a test drive. I'm gonna start it up so you can hear it, and then we'll go on a test drive in this beautiful, advanced design, streamliner pickup truck. Okay, before I start it up, let me tell you what you're looking at. This truck benefited from not only a restoration, but one very critical upgrade. As opposed to the original 216 this truck came with in 1950, it has the upgraded next series motor called the 235. In the world of six cylinders, the Chevrolet 235 is one of the Hall of Fame motors. Very reliable, plenty of power, and much loved. Let me start it up and you can hear it run. There she is. Well, let's go on that test drive. Okay, we're not far from the interstate now, so we'll head that way and, you know, we'll get out there and <laughs> we'll have to go 70 miles an hour or try because they're, they're going fast out there. These trucks, uh, with their factory original gearing, they're better at the 45, 55 range. Uh, they're revving pretty good when you get above that. However, it's a simple change of the rear end to the 338 tallest gear available for this particular rear end and it makes a big difference. You can actually go highway speed, so that's a change that uh, I would recommend. Okay, we're at the interstate and uh, we're moving along pretty good out there, so let's get our 1950 Chevy five window fat fender streamliner design truck, mix it up with these guys.